move in properly. Yeah, y'all can see me. Cause I can see myself. <laughs> YouTube, Matazidana. <laughs> Check it out. I appreciate y'all watching this video. All right, this is just a channel update, but it's very important. I really want you guys to hear me out on the things that I have to say. First, history lesson. Okay, if you don't want to hit a history lesson, you just want to get to the meat. Just skip to this area right here, and you should be good to go. History lesson. History lesson. My YouTube channel has always just been my YouTube channel. Um, it started off as me being a professional Street Fighter player where I would body people online or get wrecked online and then go to tournaments, stuff like that, right? I used to be a, a pro gamer. I don't know if you guys knew that, but I used to be a pro gamer. I used to travel the world um, playing Street Fighter. I was sponsored a few times. I was on a reality TV show for Street Fighter. So that's primarily what this channel has been about. Then we did the WTF videos, which was like reviews of like bad anime movie or bad anime live action movie adaptions and stuff like that. So we did that and then it started turning into other games. Um, but now the channel is with me and my partner, uh, Julie Roxhart, which she's over here playing Phasmophobia. I don't even know if she can hear me. She got these headphones on. So now that the channel is primarily her and I doing anime reaction videos, one thing that I wanted to give you an update on is a few things. The first thing is a lot of people have been saying it'd be better if we did two videos in one or two reactions in one, one video. Uh, I understand the sentiment because it's like one dude put it in perspective. He was like, look, you know, there's certain videos that we come to your channel for. Um, and what sucks is we come to your channel, you upload the video and it's like 10, 11, 12 minutes long. And then that's it. We got to wait either a few days to a week to see the other part. It'd be better if we were able to see two reactions in one video um, so that, you know, when we do come back to the channel, it's a longer video. So it's worth the wait. Um, I agree. The problem is if you look behind us, there's a bunch of computers like there's like a three or a 180 degree of computers like like this throughout the room. Um, we work from home, so we work really hard. We both love our jobs, uh, our full time jobs, but we work from home. Uh, so before it's not it wasn't really we weren't really able to uh, why is my phone bugging out? We weren't able to really um, do two reaction videos in one. Uh, it wasn't until we started upgrading our setup, like we got a green screen. Your boy Roshi gave us his old green screen because he moved. We added um, little foam to the wall. So there's we have more foam over here that we need to put up. But we added foam to the wall so that it's not so much of an echo in here. We turned this to our studio. Studio lights, stuff like that. The lighting is kind of off because it's supposed to be hitting like this and I'm sitting at a bad angle. But this is the best angle I can fit at because she's playing her game and I don't want to interrupt her. Um, but anyway, so we also hired an editor. So a lot of the videos that you see is from Rafael, our editor. He does like all, if it looks really good, it's probably him. <laughs> um, and we did that to take off a lot of the load from us because we were doing Patreon videos and we were doing YouTube videos. Like we would edit one video twice, one for you for Patreon, one for YouTube. Um, and before I got acclimated to it, um, I was doing a YouTube half of a YouTube cut, which was lower quality to put on Patreon so it's full uh, uncut. Then I was doing a full 1080p HD 60 frames per second um, YouTube cut. So I would do a lower quality for Patreon so that we don't run out of uh, space. Anybody who's on Patreon understands what that means. Um, but then we would do the YouTube cut as well. Um, so we hired an editor to help, help us with that. And then Julie learned how to edit for Patreon. So we kind of fixed how uh, Patreon is. And the point of this video is full transparency. We want to give you transparency as to what is going on behind the scenes. Now that Julie is doing Patreon videos and we have Rafael doing YouTube videos, um, it took off a lot of the load from for me. So what we decided going forward is that we will be doing two episodes in one. Um, and the episodes that you get on YouTube will match our Patreon schedule. So for example, um, on Patreon, we give uh, Yu Yu Hakusho, what is it, Tuesday and Thursday? We give Yu Yu Hakusho on Tuesdays and Thursdays on Patreon, but they get three to four Yu Yu Hakusho's on Patreon a week, right? So what we're gonna do is, is we're gonna have you match the Patreon schedule. 
Patreon will still be way ahead. And the reason why they're way ahead is because they're paying. They're paying customers, we need to give them some sort of incentive, right? So the incentive is they're way ahead. So for example, right now, you guys are on Yu Yu Hakusho 30, uh, and we just, we're putting Yu Yu Hakusho 66 on YouTube today, on our Patreon today. So they're way ahead, right? And we're gonna keep it that way. But for you guys, we're gonna match that schedule. So you'll know every week, this is what it's gonna look like on YouTube. But remember, transparency is the word. You're not gonna get those videos where it's two at a time until you hit a certain point on YouTube. So what that means is we're on episode 66 on Patreon. So starting from episode 67, it'll be 67, 68 going forward. We already filmed all the other videos, so it's just a backlog going on YouTube. Um, so once you guys get to 66 on YouTube, then it'll be two episodes going forward. So right now, Hunter x Hunter, we are at 50 and 51. So that started already on Patreon. We did two episodes in one. So on YouTube, it'll be 50, 51. That's when you'll start getting two episodes at a time. I just want you guys to know that you're gonna get two episodes at a time at this point. Once we reach that point, then you'll get that. Another concern that I had um, on our channel, I used to react to like game trailers. I used to have discussions, talk about other things of that nature, right? Um, and it became our channel was only anime reacting. I'd like to get back to that. There's a few videos that I want Julie to react to that have nothing to do with like an episode of an anime. I wanna start doing that again. So I wanna set the expectation. Sure, primarily we will be doing anime reactions and it'll be a schedule going forward of anime reactions. And then once one anime goes away, we're gonna add a new one. You see what I'm saying? Like, and then we'll get your input of which ones we need to add. But just so you know, I will be, or we will be reacting to game trailers that we're both interested in or if I'm only interested in. Um, and giving my thoughts on that type of stuff. And then speaking to the nostalgia, because I'm still a heavy gamer at the end of the day, and we still want to entertain. The reason why I'm being transparent with you guys is because we're about to overhaul. Um, the banner's about to change. Everything's about to change um, because we really want to be successful. The thing is, is we love our day jobs, but we don't want to work for anybody. We want to work for ourselves. We want to move. We want to get a bigger house. We want to pay off debt. Like, there's things that we want to do that we just... We don't want to wait, you know, until Friday to get paid by our employer. You see what I'm saying? Um, we want to be in control of our finances uh, without having to work overtime or sacrificing a birthday. Or you see what I'm saying? Like that's just, just things that we don't want to do. So we can make our own schedule. We can do the things that we want to do, um, and then give you guys more content. We, you know, we got to work an eight-hour shift. That's eight hours that we could be using giving content. You see what I'm saying? We can give you content for four hours, edit the other four, and then we have the rest of the day. You see what I'm saying? But right now, we work eight hours, so we have before work and after work to give you content and edit the content at the same time. And then as we're working, we're editing content. So that's why our channel has been slower than what it usually was. Um, when the pandemic happened, like when it first started, I had a lot more free time because our jobs didn't know what the fuck was happening. But now that everybody's got a handle on things, they expect us to work more, so we have to work more. That's why the channel kind of slowed down. Like, we still owe you Yu-Gi-Oh, which we gave Patreon Yu-Gi-Oh, but the thing about editing for Patreon and editing for YouTube is that we have to we have to edit differently for YouTube. So, we still owe you the Dragon Ball shirts. Like, there's a lot of shit that we owe you that we aren't able to get to because we still have other priorities for Patreon and then the stuff that we just owe you on YouTube. So we're still catching up on the backlog. So there's a lot of things that we need to do and we wanna do. So I just wanted to be transparent with you guys. So when you start seeing, you know, Deyasha reacts to XYZ, Julie Rocks Hard reacts to XYZ, and it's not just like the regular anime stuff, it's because I would like to go back um, to when our channel had just started and not just started, but when we shifted our channel to what we are now last year in March, I wanna say. Um, so we appreciate all you guys support. We wanna give you more content. So now that we have three editors on board, you have myself, you have the editor we pay for, and we have uh, Julie, we should be able to give more, more content on all avenues, YouTube, Patreon, whatever. Um, also, I wanna give you a chance to check out our social media. Uh, in the description, you'll have both of our Instagram, both of our Twitter, 
both of our Twitch, once we start figuring, like once we get into a groove of, you know, editing and recording and stuff like that, or a better groove, because we're already in a groove, but in a better groove, uh, we want to start adding and live streaming and stuff like that. You know what I mean? And we really want to interact with you guys. So the best way for us to interact with you is to let you know what all of our social media is. Also, going forward, we will be plugging our Discord so that you can jump into the Discord. It doesn't cost you anything, it's free. If you wanna to talk to us, there's a channel in there for reactions, suggestions, like all types of stuff. Jump in the channel, you can talk to us about food, anime, games, whatever. We was talking about relationships yesterday in the voice chat. Um, periodically, we'll just be in the voice chat. You can just jump in the voice chat and have a talk with us, um, chop it up, you know what I'm saying? So this is just a big old transparent channel update that I wanted to give you guys so that you understand going forward and if there's any like comments if somebody comments something that we've already discussed in this video I'm gonna direct them to this video um, so that they can have an understanding of what the channel is gonna be like so keep in mind um, you're not gonna immediately get two reactions in one we have to catch up once we catch up and we back on it we get a lot of our idea from ideas from your boy Roshi he's a really close friend of mine so that's why, like, I, you'll notice, like, our shit kind of matches their shit. Not that we're trying to bite off of them. It's just, it's just the way it worked out. He gives me advice all the time. So, but we want to actually give you more stuff. So, you'll see us a lot more. Is my point, I guess, of this whole video. <laughs> like, subscribe, hit the host bells. Hopefully, this answered a lot of your questions. If not, I'm sorry. <laughs> but we'll see you in the next one, alrighty? Mm. Actually, I should do it this way so you can see my tattoo. Yeah.